Greetings, Skeechlings. Skeechlings Prime here with episode 51 of my Stardew Valley Let's Play. Okay, Otto. Give you the pats. Okay, it's raining, so I don't have to worry about that. Uh, uh, my luck is good. There's no other TV shows. I guess I will continue on with my farm work. Berries! Blueberries! Uh. Loud thunder, spooky time. Ah, uh, let's see. Let's see, uh. And I. Always with the misclicks. Yeah, I don't have my pick right now, so I'm just gonna have to do this. Wonder if you considered because it was like midday technically, I think, when I gave him the pick. Does that count as a day? Probably not. I'm not going to consider that. Why can't he deliver it to you? I mean, how many people are he really doing business with on a day-to-day -day basis? I know Clint is a, a lonely guy who lives in a tiny back room in his shop. Boy, he has a sad life. Always wanting, what was her name, Emily. And then for me to crush him if I ever t stole her away from him. Well, be it. I guess he technically hasn't done anything to make his feelings known. These are the weird thoughts you can have in Stardew Valley from time to time. Oh yeah, I don't have my pick. Lovely. Oh, I love the sound of like picking up multiple objects. It's just awesome. Everything about this game is very well crafted when you consider it was done by one person. I wouldn't say it's the perfect game, but for what it is, of course it isn't. What it was trying to, like, make better with the, uh, uh, oh crap, what is it? Uh, Harvest Moon. I don't know why that took me so long to f think of. A game series I never did play. I'm sure I probably saw like the... You better give me all of that. Now I need food. Technically I have food, but I want to see what, you know, lesser foods that I have on hand. Oh, that's a... That's a good berry there. Put you in the good box. Uh. Hmm. I'm just gonna eat you. And you. Hmm. That could be useful. I don't know why I moved on the other side of the box. Okay, how much wood do I have now? 480. Good lord. I, I think the last time I used up, like, the last of it making up something. Like the last episode or two? Yeah, these worthless little... Why did it... Why is it, like, making that... 
because I'm doing that. Okay, I should be standing next to nothing. I think after I go through these, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to use that pizza because it is way too little. You know, I could understand, like, say, like, each one of these, like, lesser kinds of foods, the foragings, like, they only give you, like, a fourth of your energy back or something like that. Or an eighth. Because this is, like, doing not even a tenth. Yep, it's going to take every single one of these, and I am not going to be full. Okay, that's another issue I have with this game, then. Okay. And like I said before, it's a good game and everything. It's very pretty. The sound design is good. There's just some minor defects. Well, they're not even really defects. It's just things that I guess in hindsight might have been a better idea. But like I said, one person working on it, yeah can't expect much more than what we got, which is a great game. So some of these things could be like added on later on, you know, as smaller projects if it's just the one guy, you know, doing the patches and other things. Uh, the axe looks more like a hammer to me. Yeah, you can't hide in that grass, you stump. Sorry if I don't talk the most. I just don't always know what to say. <laughs> I'd probably say that about once an episode anymore, huh? I do have some other videos coming down the pipeline, though, for other things. Now that I can do some mild editing, I can make things a little bit more of a spectacle than just me talking in front of a camera. You know, nothing super fantastical or anything, but you know, it, like I get my point across a little bit better. Uh, mostly it, well that, that's just gone forever. Uh, mostly what I'm doing is uh, doing one piece discussion videos about like potential power ups for the straw hats and that kind of thing also I may do some like top tens kind of stuff none of them will necessarily be super long videos or anything but you know just thoughts that I have and like because enough could be said about one character on their own potentially doing like a long like what might be an hour long video for if I did them all I've already done Robin at this point oh yeah I don't have my pick <laughs> oh how I miss her She's gone, <laughs> but she'll be back. She's just in the hands of that sad, sad man, Clint.
Oh, I was watching Game Grumps the other day. It isn't, well, probably longer than that, especially at, depending on when this is posted. But, uh, bah. I can't get out. Uh, the Sugar Crisp song that they did. And I was like, you know, I don't remember Sugar Crisp, but this bear character looks and sounds something like what I remember from somewhere. And then I looked it up, and it's freaking Golden Crisp. Uh, I was like, okay, that explains why this bear is familiar to me. Because they changed it. It was Sugar Crisp. Then you had Super Sugar Crisp, and this is going from like over the course of 20 years they changed the title. And then, around the 80s they started calling it like Super Golden Crisp, and now I think it's just Golden Crisp, which is the cereal that I'm most familiar with of the varieties, you know, being born in the 90s. Uh, I don't know why I was looking in there. Oh, I need some more food. Okay, blueberries. I think your time will be soon. But not today. I found that. <laughs> but yeah, uh, while watching Game Grumps, they were talking about it and making the little funny scenarios, and I have to say they, that tickled me. I even watched like a 20-minute long video of... Okay, when you stand next to a tree, you shake the tree when you're eating. Okay. But, uh, they were making up little scenarios, and I watched a 20-something minute long video of, at this point, some of them are over 60 years old commercials for that cereal. And, you know, watching them back-to-back, -back, you really start to notice how much things changed over the course of that decades. I find that fascinating. Oh, the age of the internet, you you do bridge the gap so nicely. And the only reason I even watched that one video, not just because of the Game Grumps, but I watched that their one video and then it got recommended to me. I hadn't looked for those videos or anything. It was all because of the one word, or the Sugar Crisp name was in the title of that episode they made. I'm like, good lord. But I watched it. Enjoyed it, at least. Yeah, I'm just deforesting this whole acreage. Actually, how big is this, roughly? Hmm. Huh. I'd say it's five acres potentially, or within five acres. No, closer to three, I guess. Okay. Well, this will be the final tree. It was the final foliage. Okay, that didn't go off as well as it did in my head. Uh, now can serve on some berries. Put those in there. And I'll check in the next episode. He just, he just jumped. Did I hurt the pooch? I don't want to hurt dogs. Uh, yep. Let's see, how much money did we make today? Okay. Is it because I didn't sell anything? Or what? I That's never happened. <laughs> but, uh, anyway... Yeah, we'll talk more about various little things in the next episode. But anyway, thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. Follow me on Twitter at Keishan Prime, and I'll see you next time. Keishlings, roll out.